Hello, Eric Rosner from Chemtech Services Incorporated. Today I'm going to show you how to start up and shut down our turbo molecular booster pump. The first thing you do in anything that we do is start the cold trap bath. Now the cold trap bath should get down to at least zero degrees Celsius before you start anything else up. Once it's at zero degrees Celsius or lower, you start to look at your turbo molecular valve and your bleed valve. Both of them must be open all the way, all the way to the left. Once those are open, you can go ahead and start your vacuum pump. Start to feel suction here. And you slowly close the bleed valve. Now once uh, your vacuum pump has pulled down to 3.9 E to the negative one or lower, which you are lower now, you can turn on your turbo pump. When your turbo molecular pump is turned on, what you'll see is your, the green light here will blink uh, until it, it gets uh, to its full RPM. And once it gets to its full RPM, the green light will be solid. Once your turbo molecular pump is fully started up and your vacuum is to the desired level, you can start your feed. Then we'll next we'll start to next we'll start the shutdown process of the turbo molecular pump. First thing you do is turn off your turbo pump. Then you shut your turbo valve. Once that's done, you can open your bleed valve and bleed your vacuum. Once your green light stops blinking on your turbo molecular pump, you can shut off your vein pump. And that is the shutdown procedure for your turbo molecular pump.